Hey YouTube, BR Tidwell 55 here. Uh, I'm going to show you a really useful Android app uh, that will allow you to share files uh, via Samba over your over your network. Uh, you might find that useful if you don't have a, a Bluetooth attachment uh, for your computer and uh, you need to get something off your phone, off your tablet, but you just can't find that darn USB cable. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video right here and then I'll uh, show you how to configure the application when we pick it up again. Excuse me. This will be our Tidwell 55 and standby. Okay, and we're back. I'm going to show you how to configure uh, Samba file sharing for Android. Now that you have it installed. This requires root access on your device. So if your device isn't rooted, this isn't going to work. So now we'll go ahead and we'll bring up the menu. That's the three uh, dots down there in the lower right hand. We're going to go to settings. We're going to set a password. And uh, no, I don't like that password. Set it to something a little more generic. And I will change this. Actually, I already have. We'll just leave that as default. We can change it later. It's where you put in your uh, Windows workgroup name. My workgroup is named after my two kids. Uh, we needs to identify itself on the network so uh, we'll go with uh, whatever NetBIOS name. I tend to use uh, names of characters from the Avatar Blast Airbender show. But that's my own naming convention. You can do anything you like. I picked Yangshen for this one. Now that that's done Go ahead and back out of it, and then we will uh, enable it by hitting the enable button. That's all there is to it. BR Tidwell 55. Thanks for watching.